Violence Awareness Month as well, we are highlighting those in our community who work to help victims. Yeah, Yuma Catholic Community Services runs a domestic violence shelter in Yuma, helping those who need it most. Our Adam Klepp takes it from here. Violence happens to anyone. It doesn't matter um, what your career is. It doesn't matter what your uh, social status is. It doesn't matter what your income level is. It hits, um, it could potentially hit any home. Yuma Catholic Services operates the only domestic violence shelter in Yuma, and they are frequently pushed to full capacity. Domestic Violence Services Program Director Jody White says their services go beyond just responding to incidents. Everyone comes in with their own unique individual needs, um, but we provide their shelter, case management, advocacy, housing. We can help them um, with job readiness skills. YCCS is running their annual fundraiser on October 16th. There will be a dinner, music, an auction, and photo booths, but most importantly, a toast to hope. So all of our advisory board members will get up and they will make a statement to declare a toast um, to hope for our community members and most importantly, our most vulnerable community members. And since CCS is the only provider of some of these services in the entire Yuma area, that makes donations and events like the Toast for Hope that much more essential. And the contributions we receive from our community help us meet that need. CCS's services also go beyond domestic violence, helping our seniors get the assistance they need. So we're providing seniors with close to 7,000 meals a month, an opportunity for socialization, as well as sometimes ensuring that they have at least one meal a day. If you are unable to attend the Toast for Hope, you can make your own contribution on the CCS website or in person at their offices on 32nd Street. Adam Klepp, News 11.